Bristol Street Motors chose to donate £10,000 to support the young girls here in knowing the opportunities that are available for them in the motor trade. There's lots of different jobs that they may not be aware of and so this money that we've donated but also being here today is important for us to highlight those opportunities and um, help educate them on different areas that they could go into. Whenever we um, are lucky enough to get donations we're always really keen to work with those organi organisations on a deeper level so that it's more than just a, an exchange of money, it's more about how we help um, our participants get more out of their experience with us. It's a fact that women are still outnumbered within the motor industry um, and although there's been lots of amazing hard work that's gone into um, breaking down stereotypes and blazing a trail, there's still more that can be done and it, we find it really important as Bristol Street Motors and our wider group Virtue Motors PLC to help young girls understand that the opportunities are available and open to them should they wish to come and work with us or just work in the motor industry in general. Today we brought along three apprentices, they're not much older than the girls that we're speaking to today. Um, it's great for them to talk about the projects that they're working on within Bristol Street Motors and also maybe inspire the girls um, for something that they could be doing in the near future. Hearing from uh, females working within within a wide range of industries, um, the young females that have uh, that, you, that you've worked with this morning are, are enrolled on a on a, a football and education program. Um, but what they what they what we try and add to that program is real life work opportunities, so that they when they do leave their program with us, they're going into employment or further education. So today will be really impactful in terms of understanding a little bit more about the opportunities that um, are available to them because they will be coming to that decision making time at the end of this academic year where they'll be looking at their next steps.